what's up everybody it is kilo lima for lima sierra here in alaska and i thought that i would give you a quick tour of my inexpensive <laughs> uh ham radio station here in my house so here goes all right so everyone wants to just start spending lots of money on their ham equipment but you don't have to if you just want to get started and you have your technician's license and you just want to work on the two meter um 70 centimeter side so uh, this is my desk, and nothing real fancy, but um, what I've got here is my laptop, of course, which currently is on my YouTube channel, because I'm working on that, but, oh, so this is my little Baofeng UV-82, and currently I am on the 146.880 which is a local repeater here in Fairbanks, Alaska. And then that's the IRLP. So, I'll turn it down for now, but that's the IRLP server. So and then I've always got my QST magazine handy. And then I got my um, iPad over here and that's got Echo Link on it, so I can do some stuff through Echo Link that way as well. All right, now so I've got just this inexpensive um, hand mic that I got off of eBay. There's a video on that, I think. But um, so I got that for like four dollars and something, I think. It's from China, of course, and they they sent it to you. Um, and then I've got my antenna here. Um, I live. On a military post so I do not have um, or a military base I should say so I don't have anything ran outside just yet I just found out about a new type of connector that will allow me to run my Slim Jim antenna which I right now believe it or not I have inside my house just alongside the window frame here so that it doesn't look tacky in my house um, and I've, I'm able to reach our local repeater, uh, which is um, about 13 miles away. And um, also, I've done some simplex con you know, contacts about, about the same distance away. It just all depends. But So that is my setup. Like I said, I found this new type of uh, connector that will allow me to, it's very, very, uh, it's a flat. Uh, jumper basically that will allow me to run it outside the window and then once I do that I'm gonna hang it up on the uh, overhang out there and uh, This antenna. This is the November 9 Tango Alpha X-ray Antenna that you can get off of eBay or in different places uh, Make sure you buy the authentic one though, and this was like right around right around $30 so but it, it is an awesome antenna and it folds up it rolls up I should say and then this is my little go bag that I've got that my portable radio will go into so I wanted to just see if there's anyone on my local re repeater so I want to get off the IRLP because it's typically pretty busy but let's see if uh, if there's anyone on uh, my local repeater so here we go Kilo Lima 4, Lima Sierra. Hey, good morning, Dell. How are you doing today? Good. I didn't hear you this morning. I was up on another mountain, but uh, you didn't come back. Yeah, I was sitting around being lazy, so you know. Um, actually, what I, I just I'm doing a YouTube video right now on my uh, ham radio setup, just so people can see what you know, the little amount that they have to spend to get into it. And I thought I would try and see if anyone was on the repeater, and boom, there you are. <laughs> Where are you at right now? Actually, I was just going over my uh, GoPro video of my uh, satellite pass I did from uh, uh, a soda operation this morning. 
Hey, we'll have to, uh, I'll have to get your YouTube channel. I'll make sure I subscribe to that because you got some, some pretty cool stuff. Well, you're welcome to subscribe to it as soon as I get one. <laughs> ah, you just editing the GoPro for personal use or? Yeah, the GoPro does pretty well with uh, with sound. Typically, I would have been more worried about, like you said, like wind noise and stuff, just being up on top of that mountain. Yeah, those mosquitoes are bad right now, especially with the wet weather that we've been having lately. So are you out doing a soda right now, or are you, you at home? No, I, uh, I started at 6 this morning, got back to the car about noon, and uh, I'm back home now. All right, well, cool. Well, hey, um, I wanted to just reach out and show people how awesome this little, you know, $35 radio and... Uh, $30 antenna that's sitting inside my house uh, will help if that's all that they have options to. So I appreciate you calling back to me. Yeah, okay. Uh, you might pull it out from underneath the couch. That'll show them uh, exactly what it looks like. See you later, KL7R. Yep, cannot be underneath the couch. So, uh, oh, hey, I found this new type of, uh, I, well, I'm sure it's not new, but it's new to me. There's a, a flat, basically it's a, a ribbon uh antenna you know cable extender or whatever that i can actually slip through my window and get the antenna outside so that's my next step and that's uh about about fifty dollars i found so i'm gonna i'm gonna get it out from underneath the couch and out from behind, beside the window and actually outside uh outside so hopefully that'll work hey appreciate you getting back with me kilo lima four lima sierra 73. will do all right so that right there is proof that with like I said uh, basically a $35 um, Baofeng 5 watt radio and about the same amount you know 25 to $35 antenna uh, that you can you can actually reach out and and talk to people if you're close enough to a repeater of course it all depends upon where you are but I'm in the interior of Alaska so uh, Repeaters are, are very helpful up here, but I have been um, as far away with my mobile device, uh, the one that's in my, my Jeep, uh, 65 miles away from the repeater and was able to reach out and touch it. And I've just got a little 20 inch uh, mag mount antenna on it. So, hey, I hope you uh, enjoyed this video. Like I said, it's uh, just wanted to show you that you don't have to spend tons of money, unless you want to, uh, to get in, into the ham field. So. Uh, this is uh, Kilo Lima 4, Lima Sierra, 73.